Welcome to Puck Luck 716. Tonight, we're opening a tin of 2018-19 Upper Deck Series 1 on the hunt for a Pedersen and or Darlene Young Gun. But before we crack this open, um, I'd, like to, I'd like to share a few things with you. I grew up in the South Towns of Buffalo, and in 1970, well, that was a huge year for the city. The Bills joined the NFL, the Braves were the newest NBA franchise, and the team that changed my world, the Buffalo Sabres, were one of two franchises that joined the NHL, the other being the, the Vancouver Canucks. And like many of us, I was an avid collector when I was a kid. I had thousands upon thousands of cards, football, basketball, baseball, and of course, a ton of hockey. There was no such thing as a local card shop in my hometown, so we picked up cards at Johnny's newsstand. In retrospect, Johnny, Johnny's newsstand was really a local card shop. He just had absolutely everything. But it wasn't until 1972 that I really started collecting, and the most important cards in my collection were my 1972 Topps Hockey, Gilbert Perrault, Rick Martin, and Rene Robert. Not because they were rookies, but because they were the Sabres' best players and came together as a line known as the French Connection. The French Connection is still revered by fans of all generations in the 716 and beyond. Unfortunately, all of my cards were lost in a fire, but I still think of them often, and that prompted me to search for and get the cards that were most important to me. So I found two, two of these cards in fantastic shape and purchased them. I've actually created kind of a hockey card bucket list, which I think will be a blast to fulfill. And these are the cards. This is Rene Robert. He was traded to Buffalo from the Pittsburgh Penguins. And this, of course, is Gilbert Perrault. Gilbert Perrault was the original Sabre. He was the number one draft pick. He was the guy. So, so far I have these two. I'm waiting on Rick Martin, and then we'll go ahead and start pursuing the rest of my, my hockey bucket list. But every time I get a new card, I think the think of the Sabres teams from the past. You know, guys like guys like Gilbert Perrault, Rick Martin, Rene Robert, Tim Horton, Brian Spencer, um, Jerry Meehan, Craig Ramsey, Joe Crozier, Don Luce, Jerry Desjardins, uh, Floyd Smith, the first captain of the Sabres, and the list goes on and on and on. And it always takes me back to the best times of my life when I was a kid and my father handing me packs of of hockey cards it was just a really cool thing so we're gonna open this 2018-19 upper deck series one hockey we're gonna look for a few young guns but we're gonna keep in mind those cards that we had in the past that meant so much to us and the good news is Monday I've got Rick Martin coming and I will complete my 1972 Tops French Connection. So let's get started. If the truth be known, I tried to get 2019 and 2020, but could not. But I did get this on a deal, ordered it through walmart.com, showed up in a couple of days, went in, picked it up, just as easy as could possibly be. And, you know, can you ever really have too many of these tins? Yeah, probably not. So there's the guy, Connor McDavid himself. So we're going to start with the big card, see what we have there. Oh, and it's of the, of the Winter Classic. It's the 5 by 7 with Henrik Lundqvist. You can see Jack Eichel and the Swede stopped 31 of 33 Buffalo shots to improve to a record of 4-0 and in outdoor games. I really, really like these cards. The big cards, because you can put them in frames. They look great. 
and then you can just remember all the memories from that team and from that game. See if we can get that better focus for you. Okay. So we can't, and it has 12 packs. So we have 12 shots. No, oh, we have 14 packs because we got two bonus packs. We'll put Connor McDavid up in the background. Separate these a little bit. And hopefully, hopefully, we'll get a little bit, bit of mojo going here. Let's auto focus that out. Okay, let's give it a try. Pack number one. I've seen lots of reports and lots of lots of polls on the on the 2019 and 2020, and I'm certainly looking forward to getting a box of that. Looks like they've done some really cool things with those cards. So we'll start out with Redick Fasca. Adrian Kemp, Anthony Bouvier, David Savard. Oh, and a UD canvas of Leon Dreisaitl. I really like the UD canvas. Dimitri Yaskin. With your blues. Jean Gabriel Pajot. With your senators. And Jacob Slavin. I thought this from the day I first saw, the, saw this series, I thought this was a great looking set of cards. Um, and really when they package them in retail packages like this, it's like you get value. You get the tin. You know, you're going to get some young gun cards. You're not going to get all a whole batch of them, but you're going to get a few. But they all look really good. So, Justin Schultz. Eric Halla. Miku Koivu. Connor McDavid himself. Marc Andre Fleury. Evander Kane. He seems to be fitting in a whole lot better in San Jose than he ever did in Buffalo. Eric Stahl. And TJ Brody. And there we go. We've got Jake DeBrusque, Nick Schmaltz, Carey Price, Yori Laterra, Shane Gostaspear, Danton Heinen. Love to support the troops' warm-up jerseys. Tanner Pearson. And Leon Dreisaitl. Leon Dreisaitl has been on fire last year and this year. He has just upped, upped his game. Which in turn 
Oh, it's Connor McDavid's game. I think think that they're, they're going to put together some serious runs. I I wouldn't count them out of anything right at this point. Semyon Varlamov. Anton Strawman. John Klingberg. And a UD portrait of Victor Arvidsson. Justin Abdelkader, Trevor Daly, Tyler used to be a Sabres Myers, Stephen Johns, still looking for our first young gun. Who's it going to be? Captain Jack, oh Captain my Captain, Jack Eichel, Jonathan Huberdeau, Sean Couturier, Pontus Aberg, Thomas Heike, our first young gun. Not a bad one to have. Ivan Provorov, Jacob Chichern, and Kyle Oposo. One of the hardest working guys on the Sabres. I can say I can say that with 100% certainty. Next pack. Dmitry Orlov. Braden Shen. Colton Pareko. Anze Kopitar. Oh, and a Young Guns checklist. Would you look at that? Rasmus Dahlin and Elias Patterson. The Young Guns checklist. Did say we were feeling a little bit of that mojo tonight. Very cool. Jacob Markstrom, Dustin Bufflin, and Chris Letang. That almost counts as, you know, single cards, right? I can say I got a Darlene Young Gun and I got a Patterson Young Gun. No, I really can't say that. All right, let's see what else we have. Frederick Anderson. Samuel Girard. Connor Hellebuck. Guys having a crazy year. Numbers are way up. Taking a lot more shots. I don't I don't know what's going on in Winnipeg. Mark Stone. And a Rasmus Dahlin rookie commence. There we go. That's a good one. That's a good hit. Jason Spezza. Riley Sheehan. And Michael Delzato. Canucks also celebrating their 50th anniversary. Not doing too bad. We got two Darlene's in there. All right, moving forward. Steven Samkos. Rasmus Ristolainen. Lots of trade talk around him right now, but I would prefer he be a Sabre and stay a Sabre. Artem Anisimov. Pavel Buchnevich. Brian Boyle. 
Patty Kane. Tomas Tatar. And David Backus from your Bruins. Looks like we're down to four packs. And who do we have? Jamie Ben, Braden Point, Derek Broussard, Eli Tolvanen, another young gun from Nashville. That's a good one to get. Tori Krug. Victor Rask. And a Stammer and OV checklist. And Ryan Nugent Tompkins from the Oilers. Three down. Or three to go, rather. Let's get something fun. There's Ovi. Sammy Vatanen. Sven Birchi. Kevin Shattenkirk. Finally playing like the Kevin Shattenkirk of old. Now that he's with Tampa. And a UD portrait of Johnny Goudreau. Johnny Hockey. There he is. Matt Niskanen. Colin Miller. Now with your Buffalo Sabres. Solid D-man. Works hard. Great addition this year from the Sabres. And Zach Smith. Two more packs. Jeff Petrie, Anders Lee, Kevin Fiala from your Preds, and a UD canvas of Patrick Line, another great card. Eric Goodbranson, Nathan McKinnon, Richard Raquel, and Lars Eller. All right, last pack. And we've got Nick Foligno, Michael Backlund, Miles Wood, Anthony Mantha, And a shooting stars of Patrick Kane. Right wingers. That's a cool looking card actually.
Big Z, Zemgus Gergensons, the Latvian locomotive, Mark Edward Blasek, and our last card, Carl Alsner with your Canadians. So a pretty typical haul from a, a tin or retail tin like this, but we'll go through them again. Patrick Kane shooting stars. Patrick Line A canvas. UD Portraits, Johnny Goudreau. Eli Tolvanen, Young Guns. Erasmus Darlene, Rookie Commence. Our Erasmus Darlene and Elias Patterson, Young Guns Checklist. Thomas Heike, Golden Knights Young Gun. Victor Arvidsson from Nashville, his UD portrait. And Leon Dreisaitl, his UD camp, uh, canvas. And we also got the Rangers versus Sabres, Henrik Lundqvist from the Winter Classic. So at the beginning, I talked about what kind of got me into the hobby. It was these two guys, <clears throat> Gilbert Perrault, Rene Robert, and one card that should be here in the next couple of days of Rick Martin to complete my set of the French Connection. They came together in this year, stayed together for years after that, made a real impact on the NHL. So after you get through watching this video, Leave down in the comment section how you got into the hobby. What cards meant the most to you? Doesn't need to be a monetary value, but you know, a sentimental value or cards that you made a connection with that um, either you made the connection with the sport or with the athlete. Um, I would love to hear them. And then hopefully, hopefully everybody can start talking about them. And we can, we can all enjoy those stories. So these cards are going to be posted on my, in my Replin store, um, they'll be posted on Twitter. And if you look for Sabres underscore fan underscore 1970, that's me. The heading will say Puckluck716. And then on my on Replin store, it's www.onreplin.com slash SabresFan1970. Well, I've enjoyed spending the time with you. As always, I've enjoyed spending time going through these cards. So thanks for watching. And here's wishing you all the puck luck. See you next time.